So how do you think you would have fared if you had went into the house on day one? Um, yeah, to be honest, I reckon I would have gone up pretty well. Um, yeah, it's tough going in so late in the game. Uh, and I got along with everyone pretty sweetly in the house. So I'd like to think that if I went in at the start, I'd you know, probably be standing there still. <laughs> So as an intruder, did you have any particular goal coming into the house? To have fun. That's it? That it had absolutely, new, absolutely no chance of winning. <laughs> so I wanted to have fun as, as yeah. much as possible. So yeah. yeah. So how do you think your strategy would have differed? Had you gone in in the beginning? Um, definitely would have tried to make a lot more effort in resolving conflict. Okay. I would have sat down and tried to actually, you know, you know, um, just try and get over it. Just sit down and talk, you know, talk things over rather than just kind of brushing things over because I just didn't really want to deal with that when I was in such, you know, such a late stage. So obviously we got the grand finale tonight. Yes. Who do you want to win and who do you think deserves to win? Or is it the same person? Both, both Ryan, 100%. Um, the guy hasn't gone in there with any strategy but be himself. Yeah. And... You know, he's just such a genuine nice guy, real down to earth, mm -hmm. and you know he's just he's just dealt with everything so well in the house. And I think it's a credit to to his, his parents and himself. You know, that most a lot of people when they've been evicted have gone straight to to contact his parents. And right. I think you know majority of the housemates wanted to win, so I think that sh that he should win. Okay. So what did this whole experience teach you about yourself? And if you had the chance to do it all over again, would you? See, I've, I've caught a bit of flack with the, this question because I thought that, you know, like, I was going in there as an intruder. So I didn't go in there to really learn about myself. Like, so I don't mean that in any arrogant way. Right. I just believe that as going in such a short amount of time, I knew that I had no chance of winning. So I went in there for fun. However, I went in from the start there's a lot more self-reflection going down, so right. I think I think that's probably you know came across as a bit arrogant, but it wasn't mean that at all. But I'm quite self-assured in who I am, so I just went there for fun. Right. So lastly, yeah. overall, what yeah. was your favorite part or moment of the entire Big Brother experience for you? A favorite part was just um, just getting to know people, mm -hmm. um, sitting down and just having having chats, just not about people in the house, right. just chatting and just getting to know them, like favorite places to travel, mm -hmm. you know, what are their best friends are like, what their family like, and getting to know them on, a, on an individual basis rather than, yeah. you know, bitching and talking about other people in the game, which a lot of people do because they know that's what get airtime and, you right. know, that's not the type of person I am to do that. So, yeah. 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 All right. I think that's about it. Yeah. Cool. Good. Thank, Thank you. you. No worries.